Krupuk or Karupuk Indonesian or Kropuk Dutch are deep-fried crackers made from starch and other ingredients that serve as flavoring. They are a popular snack in parts of Southeast Asia, but most closely associated with Indonesia. Kropuk also can be found in the Netherlands, through their historic colonial ties with Indonesia. Etymology <inaudible> 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 In Indonesia, the term krupuk refers to the type of relatively large crackers, while the term kripik or karipik refers to smaller bite-size crackers, the counterpart of chips or crisps in Western cuisine. For example, potato chips are called kripik kentang in Indonesia. Both terms, krupuk and kripik, sound like the breaking or crumbling of this crispy snack to denote its crispiness. Thus, the etymology of the term krupuk is an onomatopoeia in Indonesian to describe the crunch sound of this crispy snack. Usually, krupuk is made from the dried paste from the mixture of starch with other ingredients, while kripik is usually made entirely from thinly sliced, sun dried, and fried products without any mixture of starch. <laughs> Preparation and consumption To achieve maximum crunchiness, most of this pre-packed raw krupuk must be sun-dried first before being deep-fried at home. To cook krupuk, a wok and plenty of very hot cooking oil is needed. A healthier fatless version might be made by briefly pulsing the raw krupuk in the microwave oven, usually one minute at the medium approximately 700 w power is enough to successfully puff a handful of chips. Raw krupuk is quite small, hard, and darker in color than cooked one. Krupuk and kripuk can be consumed alone as a snack, or cracked and sprinkled on top of certain food as a complement to add crispy texture. Certain Indonesian dishes such as gado gado, karadik, rujik, asinan, bubur ayam, and certain kinds of soto were known to require certain type of krupuk for toppings. Krupuk is an essential ingredient to make seblak, a savory and spicy dish made of boiled wet krupuk cooked with protein sources chicken, beef or seafood in spicy sauce. Topic: Types. Topic: Indonesia. Indonesia has perhaps the largest variety of krupuk. There are many variations on krupuk, many of which are made from starch with seafood shrimp, fish, or squid, but occasionally with rice, fruits, nuts or vegetables, these variations are more usual in Southeast Asia. Krupuk amplang, refer to pingpong ball-sized fish krupuk from Kalimantan. Krupuk bawang, garlic cracker Krupuk jandar, ground rice cracker Krupuk ikan, fish cracker, commonly found in Indonesia, especially seafood industry production centers, such as Palembang, Bangka, Serban and Sidorio. Wahoo is the most popular fish used to make krupuk ikan, however a more expensive variant uses balita fish, featherback knifefish. Krupuk blek also known as krupuk uyil, krupuk kampung, or krupuk puda, cassava starch cracker is ubiquitous in Indonesia. Krupuk kemplang, a type of flatfish cracker is particularly popular in southern Sumatran city of Palembang Krupuk kuku makan, another name of amplang with distinct tiger nail, nugget-shaped brown-colored fish cracker, popularly associated with Samarinda and the island of Bangka. Krupuk kulit most parts of Indonesia, Krupuk jangek Manangkabau, or rambak Java, refer to cracker made from dried cattle skin, particularly popular in Manangkabau area West Sumatra. Krupuk kulit babi, crispy fried pork skin, also known as pork rinds. Rarely found in Muslim-majority regions in Indonesia, but common in non-Muslim-majority provinces, such as Bali, North Sumatra, and North Sulawesi. Krupuk mie noodle cracker is yellowish krupuk made from noodle-like paste usually used for asinan topping, particularly popular in Jakarta and most of markets in Java. Krupuk udang, shrimp cracker or prawn cracker probably is the most internationally well-known variant of krupuk. The examples of popular krupuk udang brands in Indonesia is Finna and Komodo brand whereas the popular krupuk udang household brands in Malaysia are Rota prawn crackers and Myriel Pulau Pongkor prawn crackers. Malaysia 
In Malaysia, it is called as karapak and associated with fish and seafood other than fish and seafood are called karapak. Three type of karapak in Malaysia is karapak kering, karapak lekar and amplang. Karapak lekar, originated from Terengganu and Amplang from the coastal towns of Semporna and Tawau in Sabah which is also can be found in Kalimantan. While Karapak curing can be found in most of Malaysia states Muka town in Sarawak also historically known as a fishing town for the making of Karapak, there are varieties of Karapak lekar, Amplang and Karapak curing in Malaysia. Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> Krupuk, is most commonly known as kropek and kropek in the Philippines, but is sometimes also referred to as fish crackers, prawn crackers or less commonly as fish chicharan, which is technically fried fish skin. But in the Philippines some forms of chicharan are not made with animal products at all, rather they are made with tapioca starch and green peas, hence the term fish chicharan came to be. It's debatable if the vegetarian, kropek like mock pork cracklin could be considered a form of kropek, since there are a lot of similarities but also differences which make them two, be it separate, but comparable snacks. They are sold at sari sari stores in smaller portions, suitable for kids or people who are looking for a light snack, as well as in bigger bags at local supermarkets and convenience stores. Kropek is eaten as an appetizer, with a vinegar and chili dipping sauce, sometimes as accompaniment at drinking sessions, or paired with a meal. There are a lot of local brands which sell Kropek all with their own touch. However, some of the most popular and well-known brands in the Philippines are the Lala Fish Crackers and Oishi renowned for their prawn crackers, fish crackers and fish kropek. Oishi, being a Philippines-based company, which has expanded all across Asia, making it not only one of the biggest Filipino brands, but one of the biggest Asian companies. Other similar crackers These are similar crackers, however commonly not considered as krupuk. Emping is a type of cracker made from malinjo nuts. Rempiek is another flour-based cracker with brittle of peanuts, anchovies or shrimp bound by crispy flour cracker. Renghinong or intip Javanese ia rice cracker made from sun-dried and deep-fried leftover rice. Kripik or karipik refers to smaller bite-size crackers, the counterpart of chips or crisps. Kappa ebison is a Japanese snack food based on krupuk produced by Kalbi in Japan from 1964. Production centers In Indonesia, major producing centers of krupuk usually are coastal fishing towns. Sidorio in East Java, Serban and Garut in West Java, Karimun Jawa Island, Padang, Palembang and Maidan in Sumatra, Bangka Island, Samarinda and Ponchanak in Kalimantan, and Makassar in Sulawesi are major producers of krupuk, and many recipes originate from there. Most of the coastal towns in Malaysia such as Muka, Malacca Town, Pongkor Island and Lumut produce karapak from large-scale manufacturing to small-scale home factories. See also Prawn cracker Fish cracker Kripik Rempiek Emping Seblak equals equals notes <laughs>